So you've had a bit going on, Dean, but shit, things are green, aren't they? Oh, it's been a bloody good season. It's um, we've grown grass right through. I thought last year was a good season, but this one's, you know, the whole coast exceptional. Good, yeah, isn't it? the whole coast. Yeah, now it's been good. Putting 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 the the, um, the cyclone aside, she's been a good season. Oh, it is. It is. It's lucky it has been a good season, you know, with a cyclone and a lot of people, you know, slips and what have you, and might have had to drop a few stock, you know, units, but. Um, with the grass still growing now, it's it's been a saviour really. Yeah. And some people, you know, couldn't get some farms, couldn't get rid of the um, their stock because the bridges were washed out or whatever. So, I mean, it's been a godsend really. They've mm. been able to hang on to them and you know grow the feed and keep You're them going. You had the feed. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah. Church, yeah. Now everywhere we've been on this tour, a fair bit of damage. How about Tangy Ha? Yeah, yeah. No, we didn't we didn't get away with it either. Like um, we got a few slips out the back and a few damaged fences, like everyone else. Um, yeah. Yeah, but I mean, uh, you know, it's a bit like after bowler, you just pluck away at it and uh, yeah. you soon get it back into running shape again. Yeah, you know? yeah. yeah. You were yeah. telling me there, though, uh, your neighbour, he's got to come out on the Flying Fox still. Yes. He's yeah. gone for good, the bridge. The bridge is gone, yeah, yeah, over the back, yeah. yeah. Be here, he rode. Uh, yeah, so he's on the Flying Fox, so that's a bit of a bugger for him. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So Volso coming up not too far away now, but still, she's a busy time of year, she's full on shearing. Well, yeah, shearing at the moment, yep. Yeah. 14 shearers going and um, yeah, getting around looking at a few bulls at the bull walks and what have you, so that's, that's good. Yeah. And um, of course, doing a bit of filming here today. Yeah. Um, no, it is quite a busy time of the year. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. yeah. Now, the bulls, you're, predominantly you're breeding them for, the, for your own use because what are you running here? She's a big joint, isn't it? Yeah, well, we've got um, running 20,000 ewes, well, lambing 20,000 ewes and mating 4,000 hoggets. Um, anything really that's over sort of 42 kilos and the hoggets will mate. Yep. Um, yeah, and um, we dropped the cow numbers a little bit. We're down to 1,200 commercial cows, and we're calving with the um, yearling heifers in the stud, uh, 250. Yep. So, um, and fattening, you know, three or 400 steers, so which is good. Of, what, what sort of cattle numbers are all up there? Oh, well, at the moment, I think there's 4,800 on, yep. and um, we'll drop a few more before the winter. Mm. Yeah, so... Um, you don't reckon them with any other blocks? No, no, no. You stand alone, you know. Yeah, Tangy House just stays Tangy House just on its own. Yeah. And um, yeah, I mean, um, no, it's been growing a lot of grass, and we haven't been able to get the fert on the fertilizer on this year because the road's been washed out. But um, yeah, like I said, it's been an exceptional, exceptional season, so it's been quite good. Mm. You know. So. How are the bulls coming along? The bulls are coming along really good. Um, yeah, I think there's a couple of, a couple of quite good ones in there. Two seven one lot one, um, pretty good bull. We've done genomics on the, all the bulls um, uh, and heifers for the last two years. So this is the first lot um, for sale this year that have had genomics, which is pretty much a more exact version or better version than you know, your, your EBVs. Yeah. So um, it's taken from the DNA. So, yeah, so um, they've had that, that all done to them. So their EBV should not change too much now, which is good for stud breeders if they're wanting to yeah. Sort of um, purchase something and they're not, not going to change. But um, yeah, 271, 227, um, lot 2, 250, lot, got lot 4, sorry. There's 45. Yeah. 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 There's a few bulls there that, um, yeah. Be, that be you worth, like? That I like. And a few that you're keeping? Uh, we'll keep a few. We've already kept ours. We've taken ours out for the commercial herd. Yeah. Um, so we take ours out and um, then we've got the sole bulls and yeah. So pretty much we're breeding for ourselves, that's why Tingy House yeah. started the stud. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now what about, um, when are we? Uh, 26th of June. And a change of time. And a change of time. Uh, we're now at 12 o'clock. So O'Reary uh, on the Peahiri Road, uh, the Johnsons will have their sale at 10 o'clock, then round to us at um, 12 o'clock, and then um, they'll have lunch and that here, and then off to Kaharau. Yep. Pennies, yeah. Bloody good. So good, good big day. Yeah. Yeah. Now, bulls for yourself. I know you guys are no, you know, you're not scared of um, scouring the country for a bit of mm. good genetics. Mm. I bloody near run you over on Central Target there last year on the street somewhere. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You going for a look around? <clears throat> yeah, I've just come back from um, sort of King Country and that, and uh, going to head down south. You've sort of got to get round um, and sort of find, you know, see what's out there. Yeah. You know, and um, and what's just going to suit your breeding program. Yeah. You know, we need something with positive fats, a little bit of growth, um, yeah. not too high in the birth. Um, yeah, yeah, that type of thing. Yep. You know, bit of EMA, EMA, but not too worried about it. IMF. Yeah. Just you can't you can't get it all, but 
Exactly. Yeah. And what do you think brings people to the to the tangy hell ball? Um, well, well, hopefully they come. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think it's just. Um, I think the whole East Coast Bull Week is is a good week for everybody. They can see a lot of bulls in three days. Yep. And um, I think it's the it's the whole of Bull Week that sort of brings people around and, and go around every sale. Yeah. 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 So um, yeah. Bloody good. But the but the bulls are used to this sort of. This is what we run them on. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Yeah, they run here, so um, and and they work for Tangy House. So if they work for us, they should work for pretty much everybody. Yeah, it's pretty steep out the back there, and um, we don't get many breakdowns. Um, you know, we get the odd one, you get wet years and things like that, but no, it's not too bad. Yeah, yeah. So we're yeah pretty much breeding for ourselves. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. go all right for on the staff department these days with all that nonsense that's going on. Yes. Yeah. Good. 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 No, no some trouble. of the boys, some of the boys have been here for a bit, and. Um, um, one's going to take off and go and do his OE thing over to London, and um, yep. but otherwise everyone's pretty stable. Yeah, They're pretty good. good. Yeah, I like to uh, good, good steady crew. Yeah. So um, yeah, we'll be looking for a shepherd in the next couple of months or so. Yeah. When he when he goes, yeah. For the for, uh, for the whole outfit. For here for Tingyhow, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Not for the, for the stud, like yeah. No, no, for the well, the boys. Everybody um, helps with the stud. Yeah. The the boys are involved as well. Um, um, I used to have a stud man on, but. The shepherds were quite keen to have participate in that as well, so it's quite good now. So yeah. they sort of come down here when I'm doing it, and yep. they get a bit of both. And that's yeah, good. Yeah. And you use the horses a lot still. Every day. And thank God you do. Every day. Yeah. Well, that's it. Yeah. Nothing changed really with the slips and that. Um, yeah. The boys, were, the shepherds were still on horses, so. Yeah. You're breeding them here, breaking them in, and everything. That's it. Yep. 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 Shepherds will break them in uh, during the winter. In July, we normally pull them in and break them in. Yeah. Yeah. So no, it's um, yeah. So that wasn't a problem. Sort of getting out. Yep. Yeah. So it could be a bloody good job coming up for someone out there. Well, that's it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, bloody good. I hope the sale goes good, and it always does. Yeah. No. And, and uh, if we're there, we'll see you. No, that'll be great. Otherwise, we'll, we'll be back. Good, good. And thanks for coming to film the bills. Bulls. Bloody good. That's, Thank that's, you. That's good. Yeah, very good.